Do you know most of the time we encourage bad behavior? Some of you find bad behavior very romantic. You just met somebody and he's already asked. See, there's a difference between when somebody's asking you how your day is, how your day went, and there's a diff Adele, be careful. There's a difference between when somebody asks you how your day is and somebody is asking you to give them a rundown of what you did, who you spoke to during the course of the day, what who you talked to, what you ate, what you did this, what like you are li like it's like you're reporting yourself to a person. But to you, no, the relationship just started. Oh my god, he's so cute, he's so caring, he's so tactful. Oh my god. But you, you are not seeing that as a red flag. You're dating somebody and the person wants to literally know every damn thing that happened in your life. Who you spoke to, who what you ate, who greeted you, who shook you, who hugged you, and you don't find it offensive. No, it's until it has started going on for a longer time that you now find it. Oh, this person is this. So, don't encourage bad behavior. Once you get into a relationship and you you feel like there's different between oh I'm concerned about you. I want to know how your day goes. I want to know how your day went. I want to know how your day is going. And I want to monitor you. I want to pilot your life. I want to cage you. Some of you find caging you as cute. Before you know, the person starts owning you. Start possessing you. Start owning you like you're a territory. But no, you encouraged it. Once you're meeting somebody for the first time or you're starting a relationship with someone, and you have to run, give the person a rundown of how your day is, how everything happened, how who did this, who did that, who spoke to you, did not spoke to you, did you, uh uh, uh uh, you guys should take this relationship stuff easy now. There are some things that that's why I tell people when you go, when you are in a relationship, when you are falling in love, fall in love with your brain, don't lose your brain in the course of love, don't lose your brain in the course of oh, I found him, is Mr. Perfect, is Mr. uh 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 uh. Somebody was saying the other day that she went out and her boyfriend, the guy she just wanted to fall in love with, she wanted to try a relationship with, called her and was asking her, who are you with? And she said, I'm with my friend. She thought it was no man. He was like, why are you out? Which of your friend? You're with a guy. Send me the address. And she was like, no, I'm with my friend. And then she said, okay, speak to my friend. The guy spoke to the family like, no. So I know that there's a guy there. There is a this that, ah, 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 what, eh, wait, hello, kilo, de, what is happening? What, no, what is happening? So there are some times you'll be in a relationship, don't omit any red flag. You're in a relationship and somebody's talking to you and the next thing, the person wants to hit you and he, and he suspends his hand on the air or, he, or she suspends her hand on the air and I'm like, you don't see that as a red flag. Oh, he comes to you and say, oh, it's probably a mistake. They give you gifts and everything. And then you're like, you're cool. You are good to go. Come on. I'm telling you, stop encouraging some bad behaviors. Stop finding some bad behaviors romantic. There is nothing romantic about bad behaviors. Because when you keep receiving sorry, 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 before you know one day, hmm, it will turn to something else. Because look around you, look at our society. You see people killing people because of this because of jealousy and some of you find jealousy very very romantic oh my god he's so jealous of me it means he's protective oh my god he loves me <laughs> oh my god some of you are literally funny like so sometimes i just i i listen to some people and it's like i should just get in and start vlogging some of you because you just do things that doesn't make sense watch out for your next relationship Go in with your eyes open. Go in with your head correct. Have sense. You don't see nothing is worth taking your life for. Don't lose your life because of anything. There is nothing romantic about bad behavior. There is nothing romantic about somebody being possessive of you. There is nothing romantic about somebody wanting you to do a report about your life. There is different between checking up on you, there's different between caring, there's different between showing consign, and there's different between reporting, writing a report, reading a report about how your day went to someone. Stop trying to manage people insecurities. If somebody has insecurities, it is for them. Don't manage anybody insecurities. And if you know that you are leaving a relationship that is bad, don't jump into another relationship immediately. Heal. 
if it was trust issue heal from that trust issue don't carry that trust issue to the next person and start using the aggression of the other relationship on that person you guys have to learn to stop jumping from one relationship to the other see you in my next video